Okay, I will share to you the screen name. Okay, I will share to you the screen. Okay, so today we're going to have the cat. Because last time we all had the elementary solution. So let us have cat for today. Wait me a minute. Okay, can you see this? Me? Yeah. Okay, so. This. Okay, so we are now in CAT 7.1. Okay, so please try to listen for this one. But before that, we're going to have the different vocabulary words for men's and women's clothing. So we have here the men's clothing. Sure. Yes. I will copy. I will copy the men's and clothing. Okay, copy. phone yes I don't know come on see Hello? Hello? It's a name. A name. It's 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 a name. Tane. Ini ada arah. Is that one up? You put a run and a cat, said Rana. They were in a glugging. What's a galley? Can I get a galley? What's a galley? Teacher, what happened? Internet is not good, yeah. Okay, please continue.
Teacher, can I go up, please?
I don't finish. I have finished teacher. Okay. So, napindot siguro na. Tanawa. Mo siguro na napindot. Ano mo na? Ah? Dating ako napindot. Okay. So, we have here the men's clothing and the women's clothing. Okay. Corona naman na. Eh. Okay. So, we have here the different men's clothing and women's clothing okay so you know this these are for guys and these are for boys okay so here so now we have five short conversation about the woman who goes shopping who do the shopping the woman shop okay ready now we are ready to start look at question one One, which T-shirt does the woman buy? Excuse me, have you got any T-shirts for around £10? We've got this one with a flower on for £8 and some with stars on for £7. I'll take the first one you showed me. OK, I'll put that in a bag for you. Now listen again. Excuse me, have you got any T-shirts for around £10? We've got this one with a flower on for £8 and some with stars on for £7. I'll take the first one you showed me. OK, I'll put that in a bag for you. 2. When is the girls' swimming lesson next week? What time are the swimming lessons next week? Are they at 10 o'clock as usual? Sorry, there's a swimming competition from 9 o'clock and it won't finish until 11. Will my lesson start after that? Of course. All lessons will start as soon as the competition finishes. Now listen again. What time are the swimming lessons next week? Are they at 10 o'clock as usual? Sorry, there's a swimming competition from 9 o'clock and it won't finish until 11. Will my lesson start after that? Of course. All lessons will start as soon as the competition finishes. 3. Which bus stop does the woman need? Excuse me, I want to catch a bus to go to the hospital. Which bus do I need? Is it the one in front of the supermarket? Buses go to the sports centre from there. The one you want is by the train station on West Street. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. Now listen again. Excuse me, I want to catch a bus to go to the hospital. Which bus do I need? Is it the one in front of the supermarket? Buses go to the sports centre from there. The one you want is by the train station on West Street. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. 4. Which is the man's raincoat? Excuse me, I left my raincoat on the bus. Did anyone find it? Let me see. We have a few raincoats. I've got one here. It's long and has a belt. Oh, mine's short. I lost the belt, so it hasn't got one. Oh, yes. Here it is. It's your lucky day. Now listen again. Excuse me. I left my raincoat on the bus. Did anyone find it? Let me see. We have a few raincoats. I've got one here. It's long and has a belt. Oh, mine's short. I lost the belt, so it hasn't got one. Oh, yes. Here it is. 
It's your lucky day. Five. Which is the office manager? Is that the new office manager over there? Oh, yes, with the short hair. When I last saw her, her hair was long. And didn't she wear glasses as well? Yes, she did. She looks quite different now, doesn't she? Now listen again. Is that the new office manager over there? Oh, yes, with the short hair. When I last saw her, her hair was long. And didn't she wear glasses as well? Yes, she did. She looks quite different now, doesn't she? That is the end of part one. I have finished. <laughs> okay, which t-shirt does the woman buy? When is the girl swimming lesson next week? Very good. Yeah. Which bus stop does the woman? Eh, si Abitao. Which is man's raincoat? Saba. Okay. Which is the office manager? Letter C. Okay. Please try to listen to Amy and James talking about planning a birthday party. Okay, ready? Now look at part two. Listen to Amy and James talking about planning a birthday party. What job is each person going to do? For questions six to ten, write a letter A to H next to each person. You will hear the conversation twice. Are we nearly ready for Sally's party, James? Chris is making the cake, of course. I know. It's going to be amazing. What are you doing, Amy? I found a nice room above a restaurant, and I'm booking it tomorrow. There's space for 50 guests, so we'll be fine. And what about you, James? Are you getting the present? Oh, I'm no good at choosing presents, Amy. I'm going to call all Sally's friends and ask them to come to the party. Oh, and I spoke to Claire yesterday. What's she doing? If she's free, she can put up some balloons. She's thinking about the music, actually. I know Tom usually plans the music, but this time he's bringing juice and lemonade. There was a big discount at the supermarket, so he got lots. Excellent. So that just leaves Jane. She's getting a pair of earrings we can all give Sally for her birthday. That's a great idea. Oh, it's going to be an amazing party. Now listen again. Are we nearly ready for Sally's party, James? Chris is making the cake, of course. I know. It's going to be amazing. What are you doing, Amy? I found a nice room above a restaurant, and I'm booking it tomorrow. There's space for 50 guests, so we'll be fine. And what about you, James? Are you getting the present? Oh, I'm no good at choosing presents, Amy. I'm going to call all Sally's friends and ask them to come to the party. Oh, and I spoke to Claire yesterday. What's she doing? If she's free, she can put up some balloons. She's thinking about the music, actually. I know Tom usually plans the music, but this time he's bringing juice and lemonade. There was a big discount at the supermarket, so he got lots. Excellent. So that just leaves Jane. She's getting a pair of earrings we can all give Sally for her birthday. That's a great idea. Oh, it's going to be an amazing party. That is the end of part two. I am finished. 
Okay. Okay, listen to Amy and James talking about planning a birthday party. What job each is person going to do? You have letter A. Let me see. Okay, very good. Amy is... Okay. She will gonna book the room. And next, we have James. Okay, invite guests. And Claire, letter G. Plan the music. Next, D. It's get drinks. Then, B. Buy a present. Okay, next one. Okay, listen to Jessica talking to Frank about dance class. Okay, so if you can see here, it seems that they are practicing a dance. Okay, let us answer. Okay. Now look at part three. Listen to Jessica talking to Frank about a dance class. For questions 11 to 15, Tick A, B, or C. You will hear the conversation twice. Look at questions 11 to 15 now. You have 20 seconds. Now listen to the conversation. Hi, Frank. Are you coming to the dance class at 8 o'clock this evening? Hi, Jessica. Yes, I finish work at half past seven, but I need to be home by nine. How long is the class? Oh, don't worry. The class is 45 minutes long, not an hour. Some people stay later to do half an hour extra exercise, but you don't have to. OK. What do I need to bring? Just wear comfortable sports clothes. You can leave your trainers at home because the teacher doesn't want us to wear shoes. And bring lots to drink. I'm not very fit. Is that a problem? No. There are people of all ages there and lots of them aren't very fit. But tell the teacher if you have never done dance classes before. Are the classes expensive? The price has just changed from £5 to £6. It's still a good price, though, because other classes at the sports centre cost £8. OK. Shall I come to your house at half past seven? I'm going straight from college. There's a cafe in the sports centre, so let's meet there. OK. See you later. Now listen again. Hi, Frank. Are you coming to the dance class at eight o'clock this evening? Hi, Jessica. Yes, I finish work at half past seven, but I need to be home by nine. How long is the class? Oh, don't worry. The class is 45 minutes long, not an hour. Some people stay later to do half an hour extra exercise, but you don't have to. OK. What do I need to bring? Just wear comfortable sports clothes. You can leave your trainers at home because the teacher doesn't want us to wear shoes. And bring lots to drink. I'm not very fit. Is that a problem? No. There are people of all ages there and lots of them aren't very fit. But tell the teacher if you have never done dance classes before. Are the classes expensive? The price has just changed from £5 to £6. It's still a good price, though, because other classes at the sports centre cost £8. OK. Shall I come to your house at half past seven? I'm going straight from college. There's a cafe in the sports centre, so let's meet there. OK. See you later. That is the end of part three. Yeah, finish. So the class takes how many hours? Okay, three quarters of an hour. Okay, three-fourth. Okay, what does Frank 
need to take? It is. Oh, what is it? Letter A, the trainers. Okay, trainers or the shoes. The teacher needs to know what? What is your answer, Ringi? I writer A. Ah, uh, third A is A. Okay. Oh, uh, if the people are beginners. Okay, correct. The normal price of classes is what? Six pounds. And they will meet where? In the in the coffee shop, in the cafe. Okay, so this one. 20, 16 to 20, you will hear a woman talking a tour of a castle. Okay. Look at this. So you can see here a big castle. So let us know the castle tours. Okay, minutes. How much is the tickets and what you can see in there. Now look at part four. You will hear a woman asking about a tour of a castle. Listen and complete questions 16 to 20. You will hear the conversation twice. Excuse me, can you tell me about the tours of the castle, please? Yes, of course. We have three tours a day, at 10 a.m., 1 p.m., and 3 p.m. Thanks. How long does the tour take? The normal time is 45 minutes, but we ask you to arrive 15 minutes early so we can check how many people there are. We can't take more than 20. OK, that's great. Do you do a family ticket? We do. It's £22. Or we have an adult ticket for £8 and it's £5 for children. Where do I wait for the tour? You can wait in the cafe. Show them your ticket and you will get a free tea or soft drink. Oh, that's good. Can I visit other places after the tour? Yes. You can visit the beautiful High Clear Gardens. Sorry, what was the name? High Clear. That's H I G H C L E R E. Thanks, I've got that. In the garden, you can see a 600 year old bridge and a really famous tree which is 800 years old. Make sure you don't miss that. Thank you very much. Now listen again. Excuse me, can you tell me about the tours of the castle, please? Yes, of course. We have three tours a day, at 10 a.m., 1 p.m. and 3 p.m. Thanks. How long does the tour take? The normal time is 45 minutes. But we ask you to arrive 15 minutes early so we can check how many people there are. We can't take more than 20. OK, that's great. Do you do a family ticket? We do. It's £22. Or we have an adult ticket for £8 and it's £5 for children. Where do I wait for the tour? You can wait in the cafe. Show them your ticket and you will get a free tea or soft drink. Oh, that's good. Can I visit other places after the tour? Yes. You can visit the beautiful High Clear Gardens. Sorry, what was the name? High Clear. That's H I G H C L E R E. Thanks. I've got that. In the garden, you can see a 600-year-old bridge and a really famous tree which is 800 years old. Make sure you don't miss that. Thank you very much. That is the end of part four. Teacher, I can listen this.
And let's start a uh, question 18 and 20. Now look at part four. Take the north. That's H I G H C L E R E. That we have an adult ticket for eight pounds and it's five pounds for children. Where do I wait for the tour? You can wait in the cafe. Show them your ticket and you will get a free tea or soft drink. Oh, that's good. Can I visit other places after the tour? Yes. You can visit the beautiful Highclear Gardens. Sorry, what was the name? Highclear. That's H-I-G-H-C-L-E-R-E. -E. Thanks. I've got that. In the garden, you can see a 600-year-old bridge and a really famous tree which is 800 years old. Make sure you don't miss that. Thank you very much. Now listen again. Excuse me, can you tell me about the tours of the castle, please? Yes, of course. We have three tours a day, at 10 a.m., 1 p.m. and 3 p.m. Thanks. How long does the tour take? The normal time is 45 minutes, but we ask you to arrive 15 minutes early so we can check how many people there are. We can't take more than 20. OK, that's great. Do you do a family ticket? We do. It's £22. Or we have an adult ticket for £8 and it's £5 for children. Where do I wait for the tour? You can wait in the cafe. Show them your ticket and you will get a free tea or soft drink. Oh, that's good. Can I visit other places after the tour? Yes. You can visit the beautiful Highclear Gardens. Sorry, what was the name? Highclear. That's H-I-G-H-C-L-E-R-E. -E. Thanks. I've got that. In the garden, you can see a 600-year-old bridge and a really famous tree which is 800 years old. Make sure you don't miss that. Thank you very much. That is the end of part four. Okay, so time of the first tour is 10 a.m. And the tour takes like... Yeah, correct. It's 45 minutes. And the price of the family ticket, it's 22. Tickets include soft drinks or tea. Name of gardens, high clear gardens. And what to see in the gardens? Oh, the 800 year old. What is this? Oh my God, tree! <laughs> so the tree is so very old. There may be something wrong with the tree. Okay, so let us have this. Oh my God. Oh, I can imagine 800 year old tree. It's so, it's so haunted. Okay, so here, you will hear someone talking on the radio about cooking program. You listen and complete questions. 21 to 25. Lesson. Now look at part five. You will hear some information on the radio about a new cooking program. Listen and complete questions 21 to 25. You will hear the information twice. How do you feel when you have to cook something for friends or family? Do you feel worried or even afraid? If you do, then our new cooking programme, 
cooking for beginners is just for you. Every week, a famous chef will teach you how to make a different dish. The programme is on every Friday, so you can invite your friends over on Saturday to try your new dish. Before the programme, we will put a list of everything you need on our website so you can go shopping and be ready to watch from 3.15 until 4.30. Don't worry if you're not a good cook. Our chefs will explain things slowly and clearly. There will be six programmes in total and you will learn how to make more than 20 dishes, including snacks, main courses and cakes. So, we hope to find you waiting in your kitchen for the first programme on the 5th of July, when Chris White will teach you how to make your first dish. Happy cooking! Now listen again. How do you feel when you have to cook something for friends or family? Do you feel worried or even afraid? If you do, then our new cooking programme, Cooking for Beginners, is just for you. Every week, a famous chef will teach you how to make a different dish. The programme is on every Friday, so you can invite your friends over on Saturday to try your new dish. Before the programme, we will put a list of everything you need on our website so you can go shopping and be ready to watch from 3.15 until 4.30. Don't worry if you're not a good cook. Our chefs will explain things slowly and clearly. There will be six programmes in total and you will learn how to make more than 20 dishes, including snacks, main courses and cakes. So... We hope to find you waiting in your kitchen for the first programme on the 5th of July, when Chris White will teach you how to make your first dish. Happy cooking! That is the end of part five. You now have eight minutes to write your answers on the answer sheet. Okay, one you will hear some information on the radio about a new cooking programme. Listen and complete questions 21 to 25. You will hear the information twice. How do you feel when you have to cook something for friends or family? Do you feel worried or even afraid? If you do, then our new cooking program Cooking for Beginners is just for you. Every week, a famous chef will teach you how to make a different dish. The programme is on every Friday, so you can invite your friends over on Saturday to try your new dish. Before the programme, we will put a list of everything you need on our website so you can go shopping and be ready to watch from 3.15 until 4.30. Don't worry if you're not a good cook. Our chefs will explain things slowly and clearly. There will be six programmes in total and you will learn how to make more than 20 dishes, including snacks, main courses and cakes. So, we hope to find you waiting in your kitchen for the first programme on the 5th of July, when Chris White will teach you how to make your first dish. Happy cooking! Now listen again. How do you feel when you have to cook something for friends or family? Do you feel worried or even afraid? If you do, then our new cooking programme, Cooking for Beginners, is just for you. Every week a famous chef will teach you how to make a different dish. The programme is on every Friday, so you can invite your friends over on Saturday to try your new dish. Before the programme, we will put a list of everything you need on our website so you can go shopping and be ready to watch from 3.15 until 4.30. Don't worry if you're not a good cook. Our chefs will explain things slowly and clearly. There will be six programmes in total and you will learn how to make more than 20 dishes, including snacks, 
main courses and cakes. So, we hope to find you waiting in your kitchen for the first programme on the 5th of July, when Chris White will teach you how to make your first dish. Happy cooking! That is the end of part five. You now have eight minutes to write your answers on the answer sheet. That is the end of the test. Okay, Nick. So sorry, we have here day of the program, Friday. Start time, 3.15. Total number of shows, six things to cook. Uh, snacks, cakes, main courses, and snacks. Date of first program, 5th of July. Yay! Okay. So now, Nghi, oh yeah, listen. Okay, teacher Anne is, uh, will go to Julian school. Okay, today. So I have to go now. So I will just add five minutes on Friday. Okay? On Friday, I will add five minutes because teacher Anne is in hurry. I am the only one left here. <laughs> okay, I am the only one left here in the school. All the teachers go home already. Okay? So I will see you on Friday. Okay? Okay, Nghi? Okay, bye-bye. Yes.